smart cookies. What you can do is you can just say, uh, let's say you have a, a, a program that just uh, does a very basic thing here and It does very basic things like uh, we are adding the value uh, five into register eight, for instance. Um, simple program. Running out of names, it's a lot easier to name them with your names, right? So what I'm saying is normally this is what we've, we've been doing, right? We're not gracefully exiting, but observe what happens if I load this program called Kapemba and execute it. This is what I'm saying. You, you've been running into this error here. The reason is we are not gracefully exiting, right? You gracefully exit by using system call code number 10, 10 to exit the program. How do you do that? Well, all you have to do is load the value 10, which is a system call code, right? How you load it is up to you. You can lo use load immediate. We we'll use uh, we we'll just load it into v0 and we'll say okay fine we'll load uh, we'll load 10 using add i we can do this the key thing is once you load the value into v0 you issue the instruction Cisco which is in line number 10 and you notice now if I execute this that error doesn't come up and I see my 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 result five is in eight because we are gracefully exiting the program system call code 10 <coughs> is this fine and the thing is just uh, the rules, right? Rules are nice. The rules say um, for you to, to actually gracefully exit the program, you must first of all load the system core code that is associated with exiting the program, which is 10, into the register B0. And then you issue the operation or the instruction syscall for system core. Not system call, syscall. People always make these mistakes. Not global with an A, global without an A. It's a very important thing. If you use an A, you run into problems. Oh, I have a problem. Why is this not running? Oh, well, I mean, it's global without an A, right? 